standard 7 subject general science chapter 1 the living world adaptation and classification module 4 let's begin with adaptation in aerial animals the spindle shaped body of birds minimizes the resistance of air while flying the body of birds is covered with feathers and their four legs are modified into wings air sacs are present in the body of birds hollow bones present in them make body light in weight thus making it easy for flying now let us study adaptations in insects the body of insects is light in weight and tapers at both the ends they can fly with the help of two pairs of wings and can walk with six stick like walking legs students look at the picture carefully what can you observe here the butterfly has camouflaged itself most of the insects can camouflage themselves this type of adaptation helps insects to survive by blending in with their surroundings insects that look like their environment won't be seen by predators such as birds and lizards now let's move on to the next topic adaptation in bat bat are nocturnal animals basically they are active during night time the body weight is light there is a thin fold called patagium present between their four legs and hind legs this thin fold help them to fly effectively have you ever observed how do snakes and earthworm creep which organs do they use for creeping to understand this let's study adaptations in reptiles reptiles like house lizard garden lizard and crocodile use their muscles for creeping similarly they show adaptations in skin soles of feet and body color for example snakes have scaly skin while lizards have claw toes now let's study the next topic that is adaptations for food in animals animals are classified as herbivores and carnivores few are omnivores special adaptations are seen in each category to make the process of feeding easy now let's move on to the next topic adaptation for blending with the surrounding we cannot easily spot colorful butterflies grasshoppers and lizards these animals get easily camouflaged within grasses parts of plants like stem leaves flowers etc which means they are able to blend in with the color pattern or texture of their surroundings thus they cannot be detected by their predators 